You're the fastest person on the team. Let me see if you're faster than your sister. Go, go, Nana! I got you, Nana. Whoa! What kinds of beats? I like these bits. They give a look. Oh, bling, bling. Bling, bling. You know what I mean? What is the dog doing? Get your butt now. Why you be making her think it's okay? It's my baby Goldie. She's just living life, yeah, enjoying life. Too good. Are you ready, Shreem? Where are you starting with the needles? Just the feet. Always are start the at the bottom. thick or thin? Very thin. They're filiform. They're the width of a hair. OK, maybe I won't Just look. Here. Oh, you're mm -hmm. close to the toes? Mm -hmm. Oh, wait, you put them in my legs, too? Yes, ma'am. You didn't Mom. talk about that. Yes, she did. Yeah. She, she said did. my legs? Yeah, yeah that's why I needed yeah. you to take your pants off otherwise. That's why I was wondering why I was taking my pants off. Mm -hmm. I was like, where are you going? <laughs> Everybody I know who's had fibroid surgery has had to have it again. Some women will choose to remove the fibroids in the uterus. You need to sit down somewhere for six weeks. If I can do it the natural way, I would absolutely choose that way each time. You put one in my ear. I don't know about the ear. It's gonna, What's the ear going to do? That's going to help you relax. The holistic approach is not just about my fibroids, it's about my whole lifestyle. Where you're just trying to take, you know, supplements and maybe eat healthier. And the holistic guide that I've been working with suggested going on a trip to do all types of healing activities. And I think that this can help. Ooh! She didn't do it yet. I haven't done it. Oh, what'd you just pinch me? No, I just put the guide tubes. Oh, my goodness. <laughs> All right, I want you to take a deep breath, please. Somebody talk to me. Oh, we are talking. Oh, to you. oh Lord, you did it, you did it, you did it. I did it. You didn't yeah. feel it, did you? I do. <laughs> ooh, ooh, ooh. Keep singing, keep yeah. singing. Ooh, yep, yep. Mm -hmm. This sh better work. Ow! Take that one out. Did you get it? I did. I, I, didn't, re I didn't realize you were such a baby. Who knew? <laughs> You think color? Should I do some color? I think a nice neutral would be good. A nice neutral. A nice neutral, just like sexy yeah. brunch. You could have worn it on your date. Well, I could have. Why didn't you? Ty, where I tell you, look, I, you saw the flowers, right? Look, I these were for him. Them. I was like, oh my, you know, a man who picks out good flowers, baby. And then it was the morning damn text. Good morning, right. beautiful. I hope you're having a great day. You're gonna have a great day. I'm like, oh my God, don't text me in the morning. So then I said, uh, same to you. Uh -huh. What did I say to him? I think I replied, like, same to you. Thanks for uh, making last night perfect. Perfect, right, right. So then he comes back and he says, don't be a stranger. Like, right. I want to see you again. Right. And I just hearted it. I still can't believe I'm on a date with someone who's nice looking, someone that I like. But um, I'm still afraid because I feel sometime you'll let a person in and they'll know what your weaknesses are and they will use that to hurt you. Didn't it feel good having a good morning text? It did. So now return Girl, the favor. Our energy. Wait, you're saying I should text him now? Not in the morning, but good afternoon. Hope today is going well. It's the restaurant busy See, he's today. He's gonna think I got. He has me. Like, oh my god! <laughs> I don't want to do this day. This, this is too much work. Hey guys, you guys hard at work? I don't believe it. <laughs> All right, All right, Malisha. I know we have 755 things to finish. We are doing something amazing, and we're going to be raising a lot of money. How much? 50000 OK. So at Mommy Nation, one of our goals is to find ways to really help moms in our community. Being a black woman, and then you add on being a black mom, just all the disparities. So when I became a mom, I was like, oh, I need, I need a community. Mm -hmm. <laughs> this crap is hard. And we are hosting our first ever charity event for Mommy Nation. How many goodie bags do we need total? 75 or 100? 100. 100. <laughs> We met this incredible woman who is the founder of the only school in Atlanta that provides a private education to homeless kids. And how many total guests are we at now? 126. 126 people. Okay, cool. So we thought, man, she's supporting the kids. Mommy Nation can support the moms. I'm stressed, okay? I know. <laughs> I know you're highly stressed. I know. Okay. I know it's a lot. And we also have a major debacle that we need to figure out. <laughs> Y'all scaring me. No, you need to say Today, Destiny. This Today. Today, our auctioneer says that she has COVID. Like, welcome to the Mommy Nation Brunch 2022. You are officially in the building. She is not in the building. <laughs> so this big auction that we're using to raise all this money. I feel like we need a big personality. 
somebody who's gonna get the people riled up. You know somebody who can do that outside of me. <laughs> okay, okay, I'm listening. I'm listening. What about Kenya? Who? What about Kenya? Wait, my friend Kenya? Listen. <laughs> you know she just became my friend again like two minutes ago. But I genuinely, Kenya, would like to build a friendship with you. We'll just see how we are with each other and if you're worthy of that trust. We need somebody who's gonna say the things we can't say, like, get your pockets out, get your wallets out, let's do this thing. She's gonna be there anyway. But at the end of the day, like, what do we have to lose? 